everyone, I'm Katherine Martin, founder of Quiet Time Ministries. And every day I have the privilege of meeting alone with the one who actually created me, who made the world. His name is Jesus and he is King of Kings and Lord of Lords. And this is my quiet time. I wonder if you've ever felt like things have gotten so crazy and out of control that you just wanna sit down and give up. Well, <laughs> I've felt that way too. And I have something to share with you that I have learned over the years. It's a promise from God's word to encourage you that when you feel like quitting, don't. When you feel like giving up, don't. Here's the promise. First Thessalonians 5, 24. Faithful is he who calls you and he also will bring it to pass. Faithful is he who has called you and he will also bring it to pass. In this promise, we learn about the faithfulness of God, the purpose of God, and the timing of God. I remember years ago having the privilege to hear Richard Wormbrandt speak about his experience of being imprisoned for 14 years for Christ in Russia when the Iron Curtain was still up. And many of you will probably not remember those times, but it was very real when I was in my teenage years and my early 20s. His testimony just blew me away. He was tortured for Christ, and yet he had a joy in the Lord that I did not know. You could see it on his face. And he had a hope in the Lord that was alive, and it carried him through unbelievable difficulties. I've always been fascinated with stories of people who never gave up in their trial. Why? Well, I think it's because I find within my own nature a propensity to give up. Now that might be kind of a surprise to some of you who think I would never ever give up, but I want you to know that when the heat of the trial is heavy on me, there's a part of me that is just so devastated and tender and hurt that I wanna just either run away or if I can't run away, I just wanna get under the covers and never come out. I think probably the greatest thing the Lord has taught me over the years is to not give up and to believe and hope in Him and watch to see what He will do. I remember early on when I was joining the staff of Campus Crusade for Christ, and we were each responsible to raise our own support. I had to raise $2,000 a month. Well, that seemed like $2 million to me. I spent months meeting with people and I got to where I only had about $500 a month left but I was so discouraged. And one morning when I woke up, I just didn't want to get out of bed. So I threw the covers over my head. And as I was lying there, 1 Thessalonians 5, 24 came to my mind. Faithful is he who has called you and he also will bring it to pass. So there I am with my head under the covers thinking about those words in 1 Thessalonians. I thought, Kath, do you believe those words are true? Yes, I do. What do they mean in your situation? It means that if God has called me to go on staff with Campus Crusade for Christ, then he's going to bring it to pass. Well, what does that mean in relation to the raising of donations to cover your needs? It means that he will provide every donor I need to go on staff. Okay then, what are you doing under the covers? Well, what a change of heart that verse from God's word gave me. I leaped out of bed, I got dressed, I sat down, I called every remaining name, on my list. And within less than a week, all the remaining money was raised and I was on my way to packing and getting to Dallas, Texas. Dear friend, whatever is facing you today, you can know that God is faithful and he will bring it to pass. He has a great purpose and his timing is perfect. Thank you, Lord, for showing me your great promise that you are faithful no matter what. And that's my quiet time for this week. God bless you as you continue on in the great adventure of knowing Him.